Thank, thanks everyone for coming. Uh, I'm Andre. To your right, you have Francisco. We are here to tell you about Second Mike. What if you could watch a sports game on TV, but instead of listening to the official broadcaster, what if you had a choice? What if you could pick who you want to listen to? Well, you can't. TV is a monologue. You get one voice, you get one point of view. But people want more than that. This is what you get, right? You get one voice, you get the voice of the official broadcaster. People want more than this. People want to hear others. No, the majority of people are using social media, holding their phones in their hands while they're watching TV. They want to know what others have to say. They want to know what their friends have to say. They want to know what their favorite artist has to say, or a former player, or an expert. And that's what we do with Second Mic. Second Mic gives you live, alternative commentary on your phone while you're watching a sports game. We're democratizing sports commentary. And you might ask yourself, how do you do it? Well, it's very simple. If you're a TV viewer and you want to watch a game, all you have to do is turn on your TV on your favorite game, mute your TV, launch our app, and you get an alternative audio feed. And that feed is always in sync with the game that's on TV. Well, what if you want to broadcast a game? Simple as that. Pick the game you want to broadcast, create a channel on our app, and then just talk to the phone. You don't need any equipment to do it. But I don't want you to take my word for it. I want to show you Second Mic in action. This is Chastity Melvin, and this is Chalk Talk with Chaz on Second Mic. Started off again. Kevin Durant drives to the basket, and it's blocked by LeBron James, who's out in the open court with Dwayne Wade, and you know what that is. Showtime for number three and number six. Flash to James. Pick and roll is the default. Like, when in doubt, if, if we're having trouble, just someone run and screen the ball. Uh, it's a little frustrating. I prefer better spacing. I try a couple of passes, get into something, and you just play with purpose. But um, that's what the NBA is like these days. If the Lakers get down, take a shot, the three, don't even worry about the offensive rebound, and just get back on defense. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Just lost it. Oh, they just caught it going off with a foul. March Madness, baby. Well, in order to be able to offer that type of experience, you need to make sure that the audio and the video is always in sync. And that's actually really hard. We're the first ones that have been able to do this, and we've built some patent-pending technology that eliminates all of the delay between the broadcaster and the listener. We've taken what used to be a 30 to 60 second delay and brought it down to 40 milliseconds. That's faster than you can blink. And that puts us in a unique position to be able to offer audio to the second screen. Now, we've only been live for our beta for six weeks, and in that time, we've had some great broadcasters and they've been doing better commentary that provides expert analysis, a player perspective, and even comedy. And they've been doing this for major events, like the NBA, NCAA March Madness, among others. And when you get great broadcasters doing intelligent commentary for major events, you get audience. And in the six weeks of our beta, we've logged over 300 listener hours and experienced 26% week-over-week -week growth. And more importantly, people are engaged with the app. They're listening throughout the duration of a game. And so that gives us the opportunity to offer brands something that extends far beyond traditional advertising. We enable brands to sponsor major events that they wouldn't get access to otherwise. And for TV networks and, and teams, we give them the opportunity to further engage their existing audience through audio and capture new demographics. 
Our team has deep technology, media, and sports experience. I built a top five finance app, and Andre grew one of the largest independent ad agencies in Brazil. Our advisors have over 30 years of entertainment and sports experience, including the New York Jets. We have some big news today, and we're very excited to announce <laughs> that just last week, we did a pilot broadcast with the worldwide leader in sports broadcasting. We were at their headquarters and we're excited to, of the prospect to bring Second Mike to their audience. We're raising a seed round that we're looking to close by the end of April, and this will get us to a partnership agreement and licensing of a major sports team and TV network, and also build out of our app to be able to reach 100,000 active users and get revenues from a major sporting event. We're excited about changing sports. Come join us.